What's up people? Hope everyone's keeping safe. Today's gonna be a bit of a different vlog because of this quarantine stuff. But by the title of the video, let's go. Welcome back to my vlog. Alright, so today's video is gonna be a little bit different because last year I was a first year student at this hall and I wasn't vlogging then, but now I'm vlogging so I thought I might as well give you a tour of my room that I'm in now. Let's go. Let's begin to describe my room. Oh, so right now, this is on my bed. You know, this is where we can um, um, uh, sleep. Or, yeah. At the halls you'll get, well, this hall anyway. I can just talk for this hall, but I'm pretty sure most halls are the same. You'll get a blanket, sheets, bed, a base, and another blanket and one skinny pillow so if you're one that likes pillows please when you come down to your hall bring more pillows because i don't think that one pillow was good enough you also get a bed light and these switches right there in my room anyway um so you can read at night i guess you'll also get a notice board like this one and this is so everyone can plan their stuff out if you plan your stuff out it's really nice and it comes with pins too it's, you got this nice heater it will only turn on for 15 minutes and in the winter I think everyone will need this in Dunedin sorry about my mess it's my tripod um, I don't usually keep my washing here either but I really need to do that right now and I keep my bag over there that I use every day and in this specific room I use this top drawer this is for my electronics and my books and pens and painting stuff. Um, this is where I keep all my undies and stuff. And this is where I keep all my pants and all my jeans. Now let's move on to my favourite part. This is my favourite part of my room. This is my desk. This is where all the painting will happen at the moment. And last year when I was in my first year, this is where I did most of my schoolwork. And so usually on my desk, I keep my laptop. Always gotta have speakers. And I put all my other things that I use all the time, like my lenses and stuff there. Got me electricity board right there. Got my notes book that I write everything in, all my notes and ideas. My diary that keeps me planned, my wallet, and everything like that. So, there is my desk. And that should be the most important thing of your room. Because this is basically like your workspace. That is where I keep all my study stuff. So my books and stuff like that. Because I don't like it having on my desk or in any of the other shelves. Also up there, you have or the space just to put extra stuff like bags or something like that you also have space underneath your bed but that's where I put all my bags and stuff in this shelf here I like to keep all my bathroom stuff because it has to be separate from everything else this shelf is where all my expensive paint is and look my thing right there I just painted that last night and then I got all my other painting stuff right here and then obviously my shoes 
Um, this is a way different setup to my room last year because if you can see all of that was just full of shoes and all my paint stuff was on my desk. So that is basically the room. You get lights, one, two, three, you get four lights. So everyone who likes lighting and taking pictures, I guess this is for you. But that's basically the room that you'll be likely to get when you come to uh, in particular Otago University. This is likely to be what your room is going to be like. I know that at this college most of the rooms are exactly like this. But obviously other colleges will probably be a little bit different. But for most of them, they'll be the same. Alright, and now this is our kitchen area that we usually get, um, well in most of this college this is the kitchen area that we have. basically your kitchen you know also you will have probably a pantry or something where you can go to get your food like um, this stuff like your cereal and your sugar and stuff spreads stuff like that your bread everything really you'll have it probably in your pantry the halls like Unico I don't know they have floors so maybe it'll be different there but here we have flats and I would prefer that because you're not in a too much of a big space but here we have flats and we have one pantry for everyone and also what you have in your guys flat oh, let me just run up these stairs right. and usually on these flats you're pretty lucky because you have one bathroom here, one bathroom there, so you'll have two bathrooms, but I know for a lot of flats you might only have one, so hopefully, fingers crossed that you get into one of these ones because then you can have two separate bathrooms and you don't have to wait for everyone. But I know for halls also, they only have one floor bathroom or a couple floor bathrooms, and that is to thing for all of them. And to me, I think that sucks. But right now, I really need to go do my washing and that will be a good time to show you what the laundry room looks like. Even though it's not that much of a exciting thing. But let's go. That's our washing room, nothing more to expect than a washing machine and a dryer. It's time for dinner. But before we go dinner, I really need to change my shoes. So I'm back in the room and I'm about to change my shoes. Boom. And now we can go dinner. Boom. Alright, so here at Toro we eat at lunch at 12 and dinner at 5. But now we have to stay in this common room because of this quarantine. And look at that, we have to stay two minutes apart. Now time to eat this for tonight's dinner. Seems pretty nice. We got that. I'm eating them. And that's basically the colleges for you people. Make sure you go down and like, subscribe and comment to my YouTube channel. And I'll see you in my next vlog. Peace out. Take two!